Arriba and his team have found that ayahuasca hyperactivates the highly evolved neocortex, the area of the brain that makes us human. This is where we perceive, reason, and make decisions. Ayahuasca also activates regions like the amygdala, which acts as a storehouse for early emotional memories, specifically the most traumatic or significant ones, like the loss of a parent. Finally, ayahuasca activates the insula, which is believed to create a bridge between our emotional impulses and our decision-making capacities. So is that where awareness will be mediated? The neurologist uh, Damasio. Yes. He says the area where feeling states are generated is the, is the insula. According to many neuroscientists, our decision-making process has a powerful emotional component. When any stimulus enters the brain, the brain tries to understand it based on previous experiences. In early life, powerful or traumatic events create an imprint on the brain, a pattern. This pattern is like a shortcut, activated every time we face a similar situation. For example, if we were once attacked by a dog, our brain might harbor a set of these pathways that associate that dog with all dogs, making us fear them in general. We might even react adversely to a distant bark. Repeated events cause these neural patterns to reinforce their connections, binding them with protein and building them up like scar tissue. If this is how these traumas are rooted in our brains, how does ayahuasca affect those ingrained patterns? Ayahuasca hyperactivates the entire brain region where we store and process emotional memory, often uncovering long forgotten memories. This hyperactivation enables the conscious part of the new brain to temporarily override previously entrenched patterns allowing new connections to be made. Dogs, for example, may no longer be feared as these new connections are created and memories re-evaluated. In field studies, ayahuasca users typically describe having emerged with new perspectives on past experiences and deeply rooted patterns of behavior. 